Hello and welcome back to another show. I'm Sid and this is the two minute tutorial for my lipstick filter, which I also have a 10 minute video explaining in more detail. But for those of you who just want the uh, step by step guide and aren't too bothered about listening to me, this is the video for you. So let's get straight into the news, uh, new project, which we'll open up and then leave for a bit. Come over to our photo editing software. I'm using GIMP, but Photoshop works as well. I just can't afford it. I've already imported our face masculine texture and our face mesh tracker from the uh, face reference assets pack which are provided by Spark AR uh, and available for free. Links to all the software and everything I'm using will be in the description down below. So what I've done after that is taken a, uh, using our free select tool over here I've drawn around the lips. You can see the little, the little outline around the edge uh, and then I've colored them in with a little bit of blue. Uh, it's quite simple, nothing crazy. After you've done this, what you want to do is hide these two layers so that you only have lips and then export that to your desktop. I already tried to record this once and the video stopped, so I have these lips ready to go. But if you want to take some more time, that's where you, uh, that's where you really perfect it in Photoshop. So then we'll add our face mesh <laughs> and we'll add a material layer come down to our material layer because it's a because it's makeup we want to select face paint as the shader type which changes it to this like makeup paint type of thing and then we'll choose the lipstick texture that we just made which is this one and as you can see tracks on nicely to the face doesn't go too far outside it's a little bit rough around the edges but Again, I made this in two minutes, so shut up. Uh, pretty much that is the entire effect. If you want to export this and test it, I would recommend coming down to the texture itself, where it says lipstick, manual compression. You want to check this box for no compression. That way, when you export it and test it on your phone, it will look the same as it does now and won't show up blurry. Some of you might be experiencing that problem. You can also come up here to edit properties under our project for tab, compression, and quality, you just want to put that up to 100. So now, when you click test on device and send it to your app, you can send it to Facebook or Instagram, whichever one, uh, it will look the way that you've designed it and won't be compressed in the transfer. That's pretty much the entire video. It's a little bit more than two minutes, but again, I don't care. I, uh, this is my channel. <laughs> like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know how uh, you know wonderful these lips look or how bad they are. Link to your Instagram and I'll check your filters out. Follow me on Instagram because I'm desperate for attention. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.